Vignesh. Yeah. Shall we? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can you live without uh, a smartphone uh, in a day-to-day -day life? Uh, I think being without a smartphone is a little difficult. Uh, it's uh, to say like, uh, you know, smartphone, I think normal phone will do the job of calling and texting the messages. But I think if you are into business and if you are into real uh, uh, connectivity and social stuff, I think you need still need a smartphone. You know it is a little dangerous, but it's more like a girlfriend. But more like a girlfriend. But Piyush Punit Ashish Sanjay Prashant Shripal No, no, no. It's not, I need a solid reason It's not a impossible For youth it's a, like a, for an impossible For old age it's possible that we can live with a phone Because old age they are still possible They are having live proof They are not still using, using a smartphone They are using just a double one double zero small phones Basic phones, uh, basic phones. That also not needed we are given Still they are using telephones Yeah that's what We are given a phone for a safety For their safety Not for our that's what, that's a, we can so, live it. Yeah, we can live, can live it. So this side, anyone? Yeah, same, uh, we can live it. Same. We can live it. You can. Your name? Surya. Your name, sir? Satish. Okay. Kandipa Mudia, sir. Corona lana, smartphone lana, rumba problem. Life la. Like, NNA Mari. If a smartphone lana, or emergency, if a mail box na kuda, rumba custom. I got an internet center, wait a mail box now. If a smartphone lana, be a mail box lana, Facebook lana, either and the law. In case of a mail, you can use a smartphone. No. 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 Uh, valid reason, please. Because this is the 21st century and we are, we are the developed country. So each and every people, we want, we want smartphone and lesser price we want. Then only our country will go, go, go up like anything. I'm Shobhana. I think I can. We've all lived without phones and uh, I feel I'm more smarter than a phone. In what basis? I'm giving you a scenario. Okay. Uh, you're just going to your office and you have forgot your phone in your home itself. What will be how will be the day for you? If you're going to consider the present scenario, every office, you know, is all high tech, high fi So everything is all preset. I don't think I need to carry anything more smarter than what is already preset. My name is Sahil. Yours? Ahmed. No, obviously smartphone is important in our life. People may forget taking wallets, but they cannot forget taking smartphones. Nowadays even people have their license and even cash behind the smartphones in phone cases. Samsung Pay, Vagera, Vagera. Digital wallets are as well as everything. Like you see, if you everyone is using smartphones in every day to day life. And it is important. It is important. For you? Yeah, kind of. Hi sir. Hi, hi. Uh, what's your name? I'm Sundar. I can, I can. I have lived also. Okay, what was the how was the day for you? It was as usual because I, in fact, I felt more peaceful. That's what the peaceful life. Now I carry two smartphones. <laughs> but still, uh, if you ha don't have a phone and if you want to have a very peaceful day, I think uh, that will be uh, 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 a good uh, day. You can spend it in a very peaceful manner. Are we going in the right path of technology in yes. current sense? Yes, yes, we are going on the right path of the technology. Like, in the sense how? Just give me a small example. Everything is going good with uh, digital technology. And so more reason is there. How is I tell you, I am a 64 years man, but till today I am using the smartphone like a 16 years old man. Like that I am using. Like a 16 years old man. <laughs> okay. Correct. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah, correct. Yeah, correct. The technology growth is always required for any country, for any community to grow up and you know to be a competitive uh, force um, uh, in whatever way we look at it. But uh, when it should be filtered and it should be given in the proper, it should be taken in the proper direction. Then if it is done, I think technology growth is a must for every country, for every person, for every uh, society. I don't advantage or disadvantage. Sir, you can say advantage or disadvantage. Advantage is if you say In case of mail, Facebook, you mobile. But you can use the mobile to misuse it. Like Facebook ID, Instagram ID, that is a hack and misuse it. So that is a barrier. Yes, but that is the syllabus. If you use uneducated people, you can use a smartphone. But that is the name of the name of the hacking. But some people only done the hacking software later on, but on the back, but a lot of people are there. 
I think it's in the eye of the beholder because uh, who can see technology in a good way, they can use it in a really good way. And those who think and use it in the bad way, they can still again use it in the bad way as well. Okay, how do you personally use technology in, in a good sense? Uh, in a good sense, technology helps us to connect and be with the people and uh, try to find us the right help us to find the same set of people who have the same set of mindset, so who may not be there in and around you in your daily life. And yes, so that's how I see it in a good way. We are we are in the process of growing much further. Uh, in fact, uh, when you take a look at all these tech books, we get to know that every day we have something new that's cropping up and. Uh, you need to keep yourself updated. In fact, it's wonderful to know that when you watch uh, YouTubes or uh, when you browse the net, we get to know that even people, the senior citizens who are up to 80, you know, they have the thirst for knowledge and they want to update themselves with technology, which simply shows that we do need it. Uh, yes, it's yes, but uh, technically we say it's not because hacking and all, Okay, yeah, you can hack uh, someone. Yeah, you can hack uh, someone private, password. probably blackmail and all that sort. That's the problem. The side. No, uh, yeah, we can. Uh, it is good, but uh, if uh, overall it, uh, yes, if uh, it is uh, really addicted, then it is not, not useful. Okay, you guys are telling that, admitting that we are in the right path of technology. Yeah. If it is technology, uh, fifty, 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 fifty. Okay, okay. okay. usage. Uh, technology for kids is it a major concern? How do you just? Uh, like, where, what is the perfect age for uh, kids to be induced with technology? The present scenario, technology for kids is a major concern because they are not in a position to understand which is uh, a good technology, which is a bad technology and they are not able to differentiate between the good and bad. Okay. So I feel uh, technology at a very young age is not good for kids. Okay, uh, I have a scenario. Like you'll be having a smartwatches, like kids' smartwatches that is inbuilt with GPS technologies. Yeah. So it will be much more safer for your uh, kids to be just you can monitor anywhere uh, from your home or else outside where your kid is currently at. That's what I said. Say some technological uh, improvements are good, some are bad, but it is for the uh, uh, elderly persons to differentiate and give them what what is good for them, what is bad for them. Very early, very early. No, no, it is. I think technology is not good for kids at all. And up to 12, they should not be given even mobile phones too, according to my view. Because technology, kids, young people can learn at any time. So I think we should not give technology to kids. Up to 12 standard, we should not give. No, no. So you can track your kids at any time. So that, there are a lot of things for that. You can give mobile phone, you can put chip in their shoes. You can put chip in their shoes. So, lot of things are there to track them, but giving them technology like iPhone or anything, any smartphone or any iPad, so it is, they are not, learning is very little and they are using it for different purpose. It is a concern, but at the same time we should know where to put in, say yes and where to put a firm no to children, because otherwise they need to get upgraded with technology because these days you find kids doing a lot of gaming sessions. There are good ones also wherein they get used to computers, they know how to go about it. In fact, uh, in these days, at homes you find parents asking kids about how to operate the particular technology, how to operate on iPads and all those things are possible only when you allow kids to play with it. So, they will play from now. That's what, inducing technology into kids at the early stage, is it good or bad? That's, that's the question. It is not bad, but it's not very good either. It's not necessary. They are they are coming to take the phone. The kids are willing to take the phone. We need a phone. We need a phone. It's like generation is like that. They just for a while they eating. They were, they used to take phone and they used to see the videos and afterwards only they will eat. Now how's how's your concern? Like you are okay with it or we are not okay with it? Okay. After it's some limit. After some limit, we have to give a phone. Before we should not give it. Till you will be having some age limit, right? Yeah, like yeah. after five to six years, after just just for use, not to give up. Six years. Yes, the, for I'm YouTube. After ten years. Why should? Why should they go back but for the technology? They, they, they themselves will come and yeah. just take the phones. Around the surrounding is like that. Actually, we are bound to give it to them because we are, we are they are so addicted that we are unable to do any activities. And in today's busy life, we are also so busy that we make them so that we can be free easy. 
Okay. Yes, tech for kids is definitely a major concern. I think until uh, at the age of 12 or 13, technology should not be uh, introduced to the children because it could always be developed at the earliest, later stages. But at the earlier stages, I think technology should be aware from the. You get smartwatches for kids with uh, GPS technology. Also, you can just sit in your home, and just track your kids where they are going. Yeah, I don't think it is necessary right now. But yeah, there are a lot of benefits, and uh, see, they they make it look like it's necessary for you, but. Bottom line, bottom line, I don't think it is totally necessary. Early stage, I'll tell you that it's For 16, 15, and the early age, I'll tell you that it's not good. What's your opinion, sir? Same. Same. Early stage, why now? Yeah, what's the reason? It's not easy. 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 So, you know, kids are not easy. Kids are not easy. Now, I'm going to tell you that it's not easy. It's not easy. It's not easy. எல்லாமே ஸ்பார்ட் ஃபோனு இந்த பிளே ஸ்டேஷனு ஃபிசிக்கல் ஆக்டிவிட்டிஸ் எல்லாம் மறந்து போச்சு பட் அதனால் அதை அவாய்ட் பண்ணிட்டு பசங்களை கொஞ்சம் வெளில விளாட்டு அந்த ஸ்வெட்டிங் வர மாதிரி பாடியில் இருந்தால் தான் நல்லது ஃபிட்னஸ் இருக்கும் இல்லைன்னா கூடிய தீரத்தில் நிறையா வியாதிலாம் ஃபேஸ் பண்ணுற மாதிரி இருக்கும் ஷோர் அது கண்டிப்பாக இந்த கல்ச்சர் ஹஸ் சேஞ்ச் டியூ டு டெக்னாலஜி பிகாஸ் யூ யூ நோ த வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் ஒன் அண்ட் லைக் வாட் ஆர் த வேர்ல்ட் கல்ச்சர் ஹஸ் பிகம் த கல்ச்சர் ஆஃப் தி கண்ட்ரி வெதர் பேட் ஆர் குட் தே ஆர் அடாப்டிங் இட் ஆக்சுவலி Okay, changing the culture in the sense is in the in the sense of a good way or let's just some bad way. Both, both, way. both, both, way. both way. Um, is technology advancement like uh, is it a barrier for our culture? Somewhat, somewhat it is. A in what sense? Uh, uh, see, uh, we uh, we Indian country is known for its own culture, for its old culture. So it, it's not like any other country, the uh, 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 the developed countries. where they don't uh, 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 boost themselves to have a very very old culture i feel technology growth has to be very well maintained and very well um, uh, monitored so that it doesn't interrupt in the uh, uh, disruption of our culture yes it did because uh, we can see nowadays uh, if we hang out in this beach like four people are there and all four of them are using their smartphones none of them are talking to each other they are like see this post see this post it's like change of culture we come here to like feel the fresh air of this uh, and uh, we don't make a use of it okay yo in a way not that much but okay yeah it has changed a lot compared to previous situations it has changed kandipa technology change aichu enna madri culture in the sense nama culture one follow pandroma illa vandu vera mariyana culture maaruda namba western culture poitom western people indian culture unda everything communication communication, between communication has been over family. with with family we are having virtual virtual communication yeah, right with family we don't give time we give a time more to the technology only like computer and phones smartphones ios everything mm-hmm. that's what like uh, like in, uh, by contacting with uh, online we can talk with the people know, we don't know but at the, uh, at the real time some we meet them, them but uh, we meet them uh, we, we, we won't be able to talk by directly so we are not we are not meeting them by person yeah. instead we are virtually meeting yeah. them technology has changed culture maybe in india yes but when you go west i think uh, technology has improved the culture of the indians because there uh, indians want to cling on to the technology they are scared if they are going to lose their culture so in that process what they do is they just cling on to the culture and in that way i think technology is really useful for example if you are going to go through a indian wedding or if uh, the brahmins are going to follow any particular uh, function they immediately switch on the internet and try to cling on to the culture and do whatever is essential whereas we in india we don't want to follow though it is freely available culture uh, yes it has uh, modified a little i wouldn't say it has completely changed it but uh, it has its own modification uh like uh, budgets through video calls more more things are like that so i think it has changed a little bit so even though the technology is being rising day by day we are still just coping up with the uh, with our culture right yes yes i think totally so is technology a barrier for you i don't know <laughs> in what sense <laughs> no sense no sense <laughs> okay is technology a barrier for you i don't think so well everyone is dependent on technology it cannot be as a barrier because everyone is getting converted into technology anyhow like whether you take about banking or food delivery everything is getting converted into technology so i don't think so it is a barrier 
I don't think so. It was not a barrier as such, but uh, you know, we being more modern, we want to upgrade ourselves and keep in touch with technology. But uh, I don't think I, I ever faced any barrier as such because of it. Technology is not a barrier for me, but it is a barrier when it comes to the kids. Okay. So you don't face technology as a barrier, right? I need a one small caption word from uh, the word technology. Like suddenly what strikes in your mind when you heard the word about technology? Grow smarter. Grow smarter. Only one thing, chota pack, bada dhamas. <laughs> you? <laughs> Good. One more word than technology, but one more word. You are looking at technology. Here is Ali. Okay. Disasters. Uh -huh. Super. The last question. Define uh, technology in one single line of your own. Um, worst but ah, good but not worst. Okay. Good but not worst. I'll be asking everyone this question. <laughs> Don't know about it. <laughs> okay. Same here. Same. Good, good not worst. We can use. Try some other. It's very useful for our life. Okay. You're completely into technology. Yes. Okay. Super. Who can use it by correct way can be successful. Go watch the phone only. Go watch the phone only. Who can use the this technology with correct way? He can be very successful. Okay. It's a blessing if we use it correctly. Otherwise, it's a curse. So one word, like one line about the technology. One word again. Yeah, I think it is more like a girlfriend, right? You, uh, you can't avoid it, or uh, you just make a better use of it. Yeah, that's what you can do.